Hi. I feel like my intros get more stupid by the day. I feel like if you have an intro, it should be the same every time, or else it just gets sort of boring and you just can't think of what to do. So I might have to make something. I like the um, little music that we had last time that Natasha made. That was great. I think we should bring it back. Updated for this new channel. <coughs> I should drink some tea. Oh, I made this. I can tell you that now because I made it yesterday. I bought the mug for like two pounds and then I just painted on it everywhere. It's so hipster. Like I don't, I don't even know. But it's the lotus flower from the Buddhist lotus, lotus flower. Well, which is like peace and tranquility and just, I don't know. I just thought it was pretty. And then it's got like Sanskrit written again for peace and tranquility and calm and niceness. Basically everything that I am. I'm just a big lump of peace and calmness that doesn't do anything ever. And it's just like, yay! Just when you thought I couldn't get any more hipster, I got the knitting needles out. I know. Um, my my grand mum, I, I, we call it Nan here, but people don't understand it. She's a seamstress. And she's like huge into sewing, like obviously, she's a seamstress. Uh, and so she, like every time I go, she just makes me knit things and sew things. And so I thought that I would include this in my video. So you can see how sad and lame I am that I sit here and knit hearts. Just seriously, for me, like, I, ah, good life. Um, I gotta have any, anyone to give these to, so I just make them for myself. And just sort of stack them up in different colours. And then hopefully someday I'll find someone and they can have one. Or two. Or all of them. I was going to make this vlog about Greenpeace and uh, Shell drilling in the Arctic. Because I thought I'd be really educational and tell you guys about that. Because I'm like really annoyed and like passionate about that. But since I've been doing some stuff lately. Like I've actually been doing something creative and useful and pro. What's that word? Not procrastinate, no, it's the opposite. I can never find words for these videos. Oh my god. Okay, well, I've done things lately, and I thought you might like to see them. So my next vlog, when it's the next vlog, we will be about um, Greenpeace, or well, not specifically about Greenpeace, about global warming. I, it sounds boring, but really, I'll make it fun for you. So be excited, okay? Woo. So the other day I was watching Pirates of the Caribbean, which is, which is like my favourite movie ever. Number one, two and three. Number four is awful. And there's number five coming out. I just cannot express how just disgusted I am by that. Because they, why can't they just stop at three? I mean, they just want more money. And it's ridiculous. They're just getting worse. Anyway, I love the, the first three movies. And I love Johnny Depp. I, like, argh, I adore him. And I'm into that sort of like hobo -y pirate style. Where you just kind of pick things up off the floor and stick them on your clothes or your hair when I used to have dreads and just sort of like go with it. So I customised these boots. I do have a video of this on my channel, but since nobody ever watches videos on my channel, then actually first I'll just tell you here. I made these boots, right? I didn't make the boots. I bought the boot like ages ago and I never wore them. I don't know, I just, they were quite plain. They were quite plain. They were like just brown. So I, I like put stuff on it. They look like, they, they like make noise too, it's great. <laughs> I showed my brother and he was like, are you really want, gonna walk around like that? I was like, yeah. I know, I know you're supposed to keep your videos on YouTube at like three minutes because that's how long people can usually pay attention for. But I love long videos, like I don't know if it's just me, but when, when I'm watching a video and it's like three minutes, I feel like, I don't know, it's too short. I'm like, it's like it never happened. I don't know, maybe I'm just weird. I like my videos to be like <clears throat> at least like 15 minutes, but obviously that's just me, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make mine 15 minutes. Um, anyway, this boot, yes, uh, denim from my shorts that were too small for me at the wa at the waist, and so I cut them and I wrapped them around really easy. I actually, actually, it fitted perfectly, and so I just but buttoned them up there. I mean that was just a coincidence that I actually fitted nicely. And then uh, at the sides here, where it was a bit, this is awful, where it was a bit flappy, I put like, um, what are they called? Um, God, I'm awful today. Uh, 
The fangs, what are they called? Oh. Uh, well, I put these in, anyway. You can see them. Ah! Yeah. I put them in just to hold it for a sec, and then I just realised they looked actually quite cool, so I want to leave them in. And then this stuff that's wrapped around is just from a, a necklace that I made back in the day when I was a hippie. Uh, and it was, they were all over my hair, but then I had to take my hair out because it was a disaster. And so I put them on a necklace, and now they're in my boot. So it's it's like really simple. Like they sell these sort of vintage boots on the internet for like $400, which is just ridiculous. I mean, it took me like 10 minutes to do this. The boot cost me like a tenner on the sale, on the sale, on, on sale. And then I, I made this like really fast, and I mean, you probably won't like this one because it is like a hobo boot, <laughs> really. But that's what I'm into right now. But like, you can put anything on it. I've seen people who put like a belt on it, like a nice, girly, cute belt people wear. And it looks nice. So you can do anything with it, your boot. And this one, I actually changed it up. It was a belt, a leather belt, like a cowboy belt, but it was too big. And this boot like weighed like a kilo more than this one. So I took it out. And this is from a bag that my mom, 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 I say mom, when I'm talking in the video. This is from um, a bag that my mom got me from Peru when she went. And so I cut it because, I, no offense, I didn't like the bag. She got me when I was like 10. So um, I cut it. See, so yeah, I put it to good use. And I just wrapped it around. Endless times. And um, put another one of these. Put these on, wrapped around it. It's, it's so easy, like, seriously, guys. Um, so this is my boots. Before I leave, I might as well show you some things I've already done, so you can see that I can actually do things sometimes. Um, I'm quite into bow ties lately, so I made this one. It's huge. Like I'm never gonna be able to wear this, but I mean, it was the first one I made, and I didn't quite have like the pattern and how many like I had to do like lengthwise. So um, yeah, it was a bit of a fail, but it was fine. Um, made that one. Then I made these slightly more wearable ones. This is purple and this is navy blue with buttons on them and like things here to tie them with. And um, I have loads more that are unfinished, like this one's unfinished, as you can see. And I did and I did a blue one too. I also knitted a little iPod case. Like my iPod is an old nano, so it's like 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 that sort of thing. I should show you. Oh, here it is. Good timing, I bought. That's the size of it, so it's kind of silly. Like, it's silly to have a case for it, but I thought it needed one because I was, I went a bit case crazy. I made it an, an iPod case, a phone case, a laptop case. So I made this. It's like the cutest thing ever. Like, I'm serious. And then you put it in, obviously. And then, do, 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 do. and then you close it with this little, little pouchy thing. This is again a dread bead. I had a lot of beads left over when I took my dreads out, so I've used them quite efficiently, I think. And um, so yeah. And there's also a there's also a phone one that I made, but I really don't know where that's gone, which is really bad because it took ages. But it's like stripy, stripy brown and green. It's really pretty. Um, useless skill to have because nobody really knits anymore. So, and that is all. See you tomorrow, Tori.